Over the past number of weeks, Canadian security agencies have been actively pursuing credible allegations of a potential link between agents of the government of India and the killing of a Canadian citizen, Hardeep Singh Nijar. First and foremost, I would like to extend my condolences to the family and loved ones of Hardeep Singh Najjar. The allegations uh, that a representative of a foreign government may have been involved in the killing of a Canadian citizen here in Canada on Canadian soil is not only troubling, but it is completely unacceptable. If proven true, this would be a grave violation of our sovereignty and of the most basic rule of how countries deal with each other. We've been clear we will not tolerate any form of foreign interference. Since this was brought to our attention, we've been guided by three principles. The first one, we will seek the truth. The second one, we will protect Canadians at all times. And thirdly, we will protect Canada's sovereignty. I have conveyed these principles to my Indian counterpart, and I've also told him that we expect India's full collaboration to make sure that we get to the bottom of this. And as of today, and as a consequence, we've expelled a top Indian diplomat from Canada. Over the past number of weeks, Canadian security agencies have been actively pursuing credible allegations of a potential link between agents of the government of India and the killing of a Canadian citizen, Hardeep Singh Nijar. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.